In those days, when there was no king in Israel, a certain Levite himself, a concubine from Bethlehem in Judah. But his concubine got angry with him and went away to her father's house and stayed there for some four months. Then her husband set out after her. When he reached the girl's father's house, his father-in-law saw him and came out with joy to meet him. And he made him stay there for three days. But the man got up, departed, and set out. At evening, an old man was coming from work, from the field. The old man took them in. He fed the donkeys, washed their feet, and they ate and drank. While they were enjoying themselves, the men of the city, a perverse lot, and they started pounding on the door. They said to the old man, the master of the house, bring out the man who came to stay in your house so that we may have intercourse with him. Since this man is my guest, do not do this wild thing. Here are my virgin daughter and this man's concubine. Let me bring them out to you now. Ravish them. Do whatever you want to do with them. The man seized his concubine and put her out to them. They wantonly raped her and abused her all through the night until it was light. In the morning, the man got up, opened the doors of the house, and when he went out to set to go, there was his concubine lying at the door of the house. When he arrived at his house, he entered in, took a knife, grasping his concubine, he cut her into 12 pieces, limb by limb and sent her throughout the territory of Israel. Then he commanded the man whom he sent, saying, Thus shall you say to all the Israelites, Has such a thing ever happened since the Israelites came up from the land of Egypt until this day? Consider it, take counsel and speak out. Consider it, take counsel and speak out. This is the word of God for the people of God. What did you hear? I heard my heart troubled and my mind troubled and all the political nuances of the moment as we kept hearing the story and like that it bothered me. It boggles the mind that this is happening now. Yes. Right now mm -hmm. yes. in many, many, many places it is happening down the street. And, and apparently the master even felt betrayed by the culture. Mm -hmm. It's not doesn't meet the expectation. So he was naive, probably. And you think of the awful cover of the daughter as well. Oh. I mean, it, it completely yes. emphasizes the point that women have no rights. They're just property. Mm -hmm. 
this is the day set aside as human trafficking awareness day our website has a lot of action plans to offer